Cardano is about to do a massive move and if that sounds interesting to you, make sure to continue watching this video. Hey guys, Pingu Charts here. Welcome back to another Cardano analysis. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. I really appreciate it. As you guys can see from yesterday's video, we did mention that we were looking for a possible break below the 42 cent mark and it played out perfectly. We did get the low of 40 cents, which was our support line. I'll go ahead and draw one for you guys so you kind of have an idea where the last support was going to be. And now it looks like we have bounced once more. Now with this level in mind, we are looking for a possible pullback. Obviously, Bitcoin did do a very nice move today but again it's going to be certain whether or not that move is a manipulation candle or a confirmation to the upside thing is about cardano right now is we are still trending below the exponential moving averages and it doesn't look like we have a clear break to the above side ideally what we were looking for was a retest over here but i would like to see a three test formation right basically the level hitting once twice three times and then that confirmation back to that resistance so as long as we stay above these exponentials we are bullish but ideally we haven't tested that support level many times the more times we are tested the more confirmation we do have for the upside but right now it doesn't look like cardano is ready to make that massive move just yet ideally what we could be looking for is another move to the downside because again we are pretty much just consolidating downwards right i mentioned pretty much from over here that if we break the support level at 44 cents and we start trading below that support level it will be pretty bad for cardano just basically making this consolidation lower and lower as long as these exponentials keep pushing lower too right so now we have two possible situations the first one can be is cardano can actually break above and we can possibly be retesting the 44 and breaking above but i would like to see that consolidation confirmation number two is we can we continue pushing this move downside and we come back to the support level and we break that support level once more hitting that major resistance or sorry the major support level we have around the 39 40 cent mark that is still my level of interest for a long position because these are just minor support levels right if i go ahead and look at the previous price action for you guys the reason i have it drawn here is because we can see there was a few weeks to this level and then a confirmation upwards but ideally the major support level is still at the 40 cent mark if we were to go ahead and draw a horizontal line here and the reason for that is you can see that we had some beautiful wicks to the downside before we had that massive move right these are the wicks that you have to pay attention to because these are where you know that buyers are eagerly waiting to continue entering right you don't want to be entering a position too soon so for example for anyone entering a long position here they still have the chance of if we were to create a move to the downside where the next support level would be and that would be around the 41 cent if not the 40 cent i would be much happier entering a long position at the 40 cent because i know that that was where the previous wicks were heading i would much rather do that than enter a position here at the 42 and have that risk of falling all the way back down before that confirmation right you don't want to get caught out in a position mostly when you're entering a long position in a massive downwards trend that would be the ideal position to enter a long and then continuation now over here on the lower time frames we can see that we are still above the exponential moving averages and pretty much consolidating very nicely we did have this beautiful consolidation zone with this break that we mentioned continue lower but it does look like sellers are now getting exhausted and there's a possible trend change ideally as long as we can break above this 43 cent mark we would have confirmation to the upside once more and then it'll become a point of interest of what cardano is going to do next that's pretty much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and i hope you guys have a wonderful day